From my experience of, uh, of, of soft skills training and the attitude uh, of soft skill, uh, towards soft skills training from, uh, from companies, um, some companies are receptive to the idea, uh, it's generally perceived as a good thing. Um, other companies uh, allow people to develop their soft skills uh, in, in, in a, in a uh, more organic way, perhaps just by, um, by experience. Um, but really, uh, having soft, strong soft skills is really going to create strong teams, strong communication, and in my opinion, it's what sets an excellent organisation apart from an average organisation. Um, and so, if you're a vendor company or you're a contracting company uh, or a consultancy um, operating in the engineering environment, um, technically uh, you may be as good as your competitors, but uh, if you've got strong staff with strong soft skills who can communicate effectively, who can make effective decisions, who can work uh, in teams and to lead teams, um, this gives you a very strong business edge of your competitors uh, and uh, I think it's, it's really what makes uh, an excellent company to say stand out from uh, an average company. Mm -hmm.